Welcome back to Mediocre Gamers, this is Crimson. Okay, today I'm going to show you how to back up to your physical computer a mod on tabletop simulator. The reason why this may be important for people to do is we're seeing some takedown notices of Arkham and um, Marvel Champions from Asthma Day. I don't know if they're going to get ready to do a digital version themselves which if they do I will close my mod if they make a digital version if they do not provide us with a digital version I most likely will try to fight to keep my mod going because of the fact that a we're living in wonderful times where people can't go to the card shop and play with each other uh, that's just not feasible um, on top of that, the whole reason why I made my mod in the first place is I have multiple friends who live out of town and I can't play and I also would like to make videos. Um, making videos and having a setup with a camera pointing at a table is just a little hard for me in my limited living space. So it is much easier for me to do it with a program with like Tabletop Simulator. So, first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to this address. I will have a link down below and download this program from Nexus Mod called TTS Mod Backup. Now, you will need to make an account, sign, sign up for an account. There is a free uh, account that you can use. Then click download. You're going to get a zip file and you're going to get this item here. Yes, you get to see my wonderfully cluttered desktop. Okay, so once you have this here, you're going to open it, and you and it's going to ask you where your tabletop simulator folder is. If you do not know where that is, go ahead and start Steam. Go to your tabletop simulator. Right-click Properties. Go to Local Files. Go to Browse Local Files and then just copy and paste this over. Once you have that, you'll place it in here and it'll find all your mods that you have for um, tabletop. And just type in, if you're looking for my mod, um, doo -doo -doo -doo. there we go. I believe that is the right one. That does look to be the right one. Now, now you can click backup. It's going to say some files are missing. I don't know why. There shouldn't be any. And then just place them in a folder that you want to pl place anywhere on one of your hard drives. Click OK. Starting backup of Marvel Champion LL or LCG. And it will take a couple moments here. I also suggest that you download it so we have all the assets on your computer also uh, and not just in a backup form. And then what you can do once you have this is you'll get a JSON file and at that point you can load that file in put put that JSON file into your tabletop simulator mods folder and then bam it'll be there it's local on your computer not on their server so if it gets taken down you will still have access to the mod in the state that it was when you backed it up or downloaded it this way if you are like me and need to play with friends that are out of town now granted all of my friends who I play with we have all bought the game multiple times over in fact I've had I bought two of every pack and corset, even though you only need one. But I do that so that way I have the extra cards. That way when I do go to the card shop and I do learn to plays and stuff like that, I have multiple cards available. But they they seem to think that, you know, if you play tabletop you're just gonna you're just pirating their stuff. And that's not what it's about. It's it's about ease of access for when you can't play in person. Most people who download my mod, I, I'm going to tell you right now, most of them either would not buy the cards in real in real life anyways, 
or most likely have bought the cards in real life and are looking to play with friends while we are stuck in this pandemic. Um, no, that's not saying everybody is, but it's so so little that it's not even funny. I mean, this has been proven over and over and over again that digital versions do not hurt sales of products like that. Um, you know, we, saw, we saw it with the music industry. We've seen it with, you know, Netflix. You know, Netflix doesn't hurt the sales of Walmart. Walmart still makes billions of dollars. Um, it's just a stupid argument. But what can you do? You know, old people have this thought in their head that if people have access it one way, they won't buy it another way. And you can't change old people because, well, they're old. Okay, so backup is complete. Let's go ahead and just also download. And this is just downloading it into the right, into your fo folder there. And that's going to take a couple moments too. And then once you have that done, if the mod does go down, you can grab that the file name you can you know import a back backup and be ready to play it again hope this video helped you guys thank you guys again for watching I'm gonna put a nice little video clip here with my thoughts on this hide the planet hide the planet shut up and get in the car hide the planet hide the planet